Philippians chapter 1, verses 3 to 6. Every time I think of you, I give thanks to my God. Whenever I pray, I make my requests for all of you with joy, for you have been my partners in spreading the good news about Christ from the time you first heard it until now. And I am certain that God, who began the good work within you, will continue his work until it is finally finished on the day when Christ Jesus returns. Amen. So here Paul is writing to the church at Philippi, and first of all he says that every time he thinks of them, he gives thanks to God. And I want maybe today for us to take time out to give thanks for the church, to give thanks for our brothers and sisters. Every time we think of them, let's thank God for joining us together in him. Think of your local church, give thanks for your local church, that which God has put you in to serve and to fellowship and to learn. And then think of the churches we're connected to all over the world. Uh, give thanks for our brothers and sisters across the world. And then he says, when I pray, I make my request for you with joy. And so take time to pray for our brothers and sisters. There are those that are in need, those that are struggling, those that have lost loved ones, those that are ill. Let's take time to pray, make our request to God. And let's consider it a joy to have that privilege of praying for the church in this way. And then he says that you have been my partners in spreading the good news about Christ. And I want us to know that we are the body of Christ. We are partners in this work. Every one of us has a role to play. And today, God has given you a task. He's given you a role to play in the body of Christ as we're scattered uh, into the world. He says, you can be a partner in this wonderful gospel redemption plan that I have, which I, where God is using the church to bring out his purposes. Together we're partners for the gospel. And then he says that God who has started the work within you will continue his work until it is finally finished on the day that Christ Jesus returns. Just be aware today that God is still working in you. That which he started, he will complete. He is making you and us, the church, to be ready for Christ's return. God bless you.